While preparing for CSI NET examination, there were some items which really made my study easier faster and effective. So in this video, I will share those items with you so that you can also make your studies easier, faster and more effective. So let's begin. Hello Geniuses, welcome to the second part of this Methogenius competitive exam series. In this series, I am sharing all the things which I learned while preparing for CSI NET examination. Now before starting this video, let me introduce you to the sponsors of this video named Matchster. Now this is a really fun, interesting and engaging math game. If you want to practice math in a fun way, then this game is for you. This game will practice your mental math skills in a really engaging way. So try out this really interesting game from the link in the description of this video. So now let's come back to the video. Now the first and the most useful thing according to me was this paperless LCD tablet. Now to be clear, this is not a real digital tablet which costs a lot of money. This is a really affordable tablet in which you can write and by pressing this button you can erase whatever you wrote. There is no memory etc etc in it. This is just a paperless tablet and its best use was solving numerical type questions because in that we make a lot of mistakes then I will completely erase whatever I wrote then I will do it again. So being a science student if you want to practice on something then this tablet is for you. Now the second thing which I want to share is flashcards. Okay now three days before my CSI net examination I did nothing just to review flashcards. If you don't know what flashcards are you can watch this video and also if you don't want to buy them you can also make your own flashcards by cutting paper in squares but they are really hard to organize but these flashcards come with some kind of clips so that you can organize them too now i know that a lots and lots of students are not able to afford a full study setup like this table and a good chair also okay now for those this is a really nice alternative this is a small study table which comes under 500 rupees in india now i also got this study table because it is really portable it is because nobody wants to study at a single place for 8 8 hours we want to switch places so with this really portable table i can study outside so this is a really nice thing to buy if you like to study at different different places now without a plan you cannot prepare for a certain examination or test okay so you need to plan carefully and for planning the best thing which i got was this erasable notebook because in this notebook we can write whatever we need like a timetable a schedule etc etc and we can also erase it completely so this was really nice but remember this this notebook uses a special pen which comes with it too. Now another really important thing which you can buy is a small whiteboard. The thing is that it is similar to that tablet which I have shown earlier but bigger. Like if there is a place in your home which is regularly in front of you then you should attach that whiteboard there. You can write all the important things which you want to remember there on the whiteboard and it will be in front of you regularly so it will help you memorize that thing. And also while writing in a notebook our face is like this but while writing in a board our face is like this. So it will also relax our neck too. So like if you are preparing for an exam and like studying 8 hours a day then you can switch between like this and this so it will help you reduce your neck stress etc etc now here are some other things which you can buy they are like the honorable mentions in this list first thing is a phone stand the device which I used to took online classes on was my phone and having a good phone stand really helped me keep it at a right angle so that my neck doesn't stress much okay another really important thing which you can buy is a lamp I would recommend this one because it was like small and it was rechargeable and it had three different lights based on the mood. Another thing which is not very necessary but if you have it is really good is to buy a smartwatch because it have really good features to like remind you some stuff. And another really good thing about smartwatches is that if you set an alarm it will vibrate on your hand. So you can wake up at any time without disturbing others with you. And also in most of the smartwatches there is this water reminder feature which reminds you to drink water and drinking water regularly is really important because our brain works by using three things that is oxygen, energy and water and when we are really like involved in studying something we forget to drink it. So the watch will remind you to drink water. 
so i've added the link to buy this one in the description of this video if you can buy it then that's great if not then it's fine too so i hope you have enjoyed this video thanks for watching this video and always remember that math is everything